this organization, organiz long neck, what is it called? A long neck? I'm kind of interested how many times I'm gonna say cute in this video. Anybody have an idea? Okay. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well today. I wanted to do this video because our little man got so many gifts from friends and family that I wanted to like unbox everything with you guys and show you what he got. These giant things are in boxes so I will be discussing them but then I will be showing you some b-roll because I don't have time to unbox these and all that stuff right now. But anyway, he did get a ton of stuff which I also did forget another bag over there but I believe that's just like wipes and stuff. But anyway, he got so many things, pacifiers and chewy thingies, chewy thingies, teething toys and just so many things. So if you guys don't know me, my name is Jess and I make videos about motherhood and my lifestyle and kind of everything that goes along with my life. It's a little crazy, it's a little fun, but I hope you are here to stay and come along on our crazy journey. Then make sure to hit that subscribe button and join this community of amazing people, moms that just spread nothing but love and positivity. So with that being said, I'm gonna jump right in and show you guys what he got. His room is not done. Like, there's nothing on the walls. There's nothing here. There's nothing going on. But I wanted to go through, like, bag by bag. I also have this big thing behind me, which I'll probably be moving, which I will move um, to the side because, uh, yeah, I would have forgotten about it. And it's completely full. It's completely full of just, like, so many things. So he got clothes. He got toys. He got teddy bears. He got organizational things. Um, yeah, so many things. And I say that he got a lot of these things, but also like I am going to benefit from them immensely just because they're so handy. Like the first thing I will show you guys is something that's going to help me so much because he has a giant closet and his closet has little drawers. I got, or he got, organizer so I can put like his little onesies his socks his little hats I don't know whatever can fit in here will go in there and it'll make the drawers just way more organized and it'll help me out a ton I'm not doing this in any specific order I am doing this so that way I can just show you guys everything so we're gonna go to things that we're gonna be putting on his walls so if you haven't guessed from the last video I did about him um, and asking if you guys knew what theme his bedroom was going to be if you guessed dinosaurs you are absolutely correct so we got this dinosaur actually it's actually it's pretty big it's pretty big it's like <laughs> i don't know it's big anyway so there's this orange dinosaur it's going to go on his wall i'm not sure where it's going to go yet it might go over his changing table but when i decorate his nursery i will definitely take you guys along with me and you will see exactly where i put this thing and there are actually other ones that i wanted to get him but they weren't in good shape at the store they were kind of like beaten up a little bit so i did not get him any more than this but i am trying to so i am very excited to put this up on his wall i'm going to try and get him other ones to kind of match it and we're gonna go from there another little dinosaur thing that i got him for his wall which not really sure where i'm gonna put this either but again i'm gonna take you guys along for it once we start decorating his nursery is this little guy so this is little man cave and it has like a little what is this stegosaurus i have no idea i just think it's super cute the colors we're going for are not too bright and in your face but kind of more on like the neutrally kind of duller side like pastels that's at least what i'm trying to do for his room just so that way it's not too crazy and bright so yeah we got this little cute sign that's gonna go somewhere because this is gonna be his little man cave so this is going to hang on his door i believe I believe when he is born because we're going to be able to put his name, his weight, his height, the time he was born, the date he was born, and yeah, it's just going to be super cute and it's going to hang on his door. I got this for him just because I thought this was super, super cute, and yeah, so it says, hello, I'm new here, and then you put in all of his, his information, and I just think it's the cutest little thing ever. So now I think we're gonna dig into this bag. I did see some of these things, I didn't see all of them, so I don't really know what's in all of these bags. So that's why I thought this video was going to be exciting as well. Um, okay, so the first thing is this 
the noggin nest head support so this goes in the car seat I have actually seen this many many times I've used this with Charlotte but we did need new ones because that was three years ago when we used them for Charlotte so that was on our registry and yeah it's super cute it has like little elephants on it and it's gray and it's gonna go right in his car seat and I'm super excited about it I love that because it's gonna support his little head but it can also go in his swing actually which his swing is right here <laughs> anyway I will get to that soon this can also go in his swing as well as his car seat and then you can also put it in the stroller I believe just for like added support so we did also ask I mean some of these things I haven't seen yet but also it's not really too much of a surprise because we did put this on our registry we asked for two extra changing mats like on the go changing mats for the diaper bag I use them so frequently with Charlotte and I just had one and it would get so gross like all the time and it was just like I didn't have time to really wash it and stick it back in the bag so then I can wash one and then I can just stick a new one in the bag while this one is being washed so I just thought that was a really great idea so they're just standard changing pads which I will open one and I'll show you guys what it looks like so literally just the changing pad like just a black pad it has like a squishy back which when they lay down on it is going to be comfortable for them this is the brand Obersee. never heard of it just saw it on bye bye baby and yeah we needed these just because we used them so much with charlotte and they were great so the last few things that were in this bag are pacifiers these are the best pacifiers we have ever used charlotte used these when she was a baby they're zero oop they are zero to three months but they also make three plus months so these zero to three months ones are just really soft um really nice for their mouth not all babies use pacifiers but charlotte definitely did you never know i mean maybe he won't like them but maybe he will so we have them just in case the hospital gives you these exact pacifiers we loved them so much we found them in the store and we started buying them and they're freaking fantastic i absolutely love them so he has pacifiers and then he got these cute little hats. Oh my God, look at these hats. Are you kidding? It says, I have arrived. It's a three pack of hats. So that, the little blue one, and then just a plain gray one. And we love these hats because for some reason, Phil and I just like to have kids in the winter time. I don't know why, <laughs> but anyway, he's gonna be here in January, which is literally next month. Oh my god, I didn't even think about how soon this baby is going to be here. He's going to be here next month, which makes me very emotional. And he is going to put his little head in these little hats. And it's so freaking cute. And the last thing in the bag were these cute little onesies. Oh my gosh. So these are more onesies from the brand Gerber, which is what I was talking to you guys about in the video where I did the baby boy haul. I got a lot of Gerber clothes for him and they are really great quality. I don't know how they're going to do on him. However, just feeling them and touching them like they're very soft, they're very they're very sturdy, they're made really nicely. And yeah, it's a pack of two. So this one has little stars on it and it's gray and it says that you will always be loved with a little elephant and like a little chick thing. <laughs> Super cute. A chick and a turtle, that's what it is. And then there's another one on the back. It's very similar. It is the elephant with the chick and the turtle. They're footies, so that's good for him as well. And these are in size zero to three months. So they look a little big, and it's that's crazy to say that they look a little big because they're so freaking tiny. But they do look a little big, so maybe he'll wear them, um, you know, when he's closer to two or three months old. But who knows, because he might be a big old boy <laughs> at birth. Let's hope not. Okay, so just some random things that are sitting next to me I'm gonna pull up really quick um, because I, we just have more pacifiers. Just the same same ones. These are the same exact ones, zero to three months. And then these are again zero to three months, but they are like a different shape. If you can see that this shape is like way different. It's kind of like a bean shaped and this is, this is a circle. Either way, it doesn't matter. We're just gonna see if he likes them. And then we also have a teething ring for him. It's a natural wood and silicone teether for three months plus. Charlotte got teeth. She got her first tooth, I should say at two months old so we don't know when this little man is going to be getting his teeth but this is the teether that we got him and it's wood right here so it's all natural wood that is not going to be damaging to him but then there's like these silicone little keys and then this blue part right here is silicone as well so 
that is going to be really handy when we're in the car and he's in the car seat or you know whenever he can learn to grab things and put them near his mouth all right so continuing over to the more random things i got him another fitted crib sheet and i bought this for him when i was in target the other day just because i saw it and i was like wow his theme is dinosaurs and i just want to get him a dinosaur themed fitted sheet so we already have one in his crib right now and it's dark blue and it has dinosaurs all over it in different colors like greens and lighter blues and then he's got a dinosaur blanket in there so um it's really cozy in there already for him but then i saw this guy at target and i wanted to get it for him just because it looks so cute he's probably not going to be in his crib right away but um yeah you never know okay the next order we got was from amazon and I bought this stuff myself only because we did get gift cards from people to Amazon for Baby Boy, but we also got cash for Baby Boy. So anything that was on our registry that we didn't necessarily get from people, we just ordered ourselves, which was totally fine and awesome. So we got these burp cloths. I don't know why I'm opening them, but I'm gonna show you what they're like. Ooh, they're really, really soft. So, oh wow, they're like, can you even, can you see that material? Like that's like fleece. It's like a fleecy material. So we got a whole pack of them. So this was like $7, I believe. And it comes with eight fur cloths. So there's eight of them in here and they're really, really soft. So this is gonna be really nice for him. Um, hopefully he likes it and it's absorbent. I don't know, if it's not, I guess we'll have to work with it and see what happens. All right, the next thing from Amazon is this on the go noise machine. It's a hush noise machine. These have saved our life time and time again. Charlotte still uses hers and she's gonna be three this month. It's just really awesome. We don't have a full size one for him yet, but we got this so I can clip it to my diaper bag. When we're on the go, we can put it in his car seat, possibly when he's in the car with us. We can do so many different things with this. So it was like $20 on Amazon. And yeah, we just wanted a portable noise machine because we could have used one with Charlotte, but we never really thought about it. So we got one for little man. We also got a pack, well, a three pack of swaddles. Again, I'm not sure if he's going to like swaddles, but just to be on the safe side, if he does enjoy swaddles, I wanted to have them on hand. So we're going to try swaddling him, obviously, in the hospital and see how he does with it. But I bought them for home. So they're just three generic uh, swaddles, just gray with stripes and arrows and a plain gray one and polka dots. So yeah, we got the three swaddles. It's by Comfy Cubs. We got this on Amazon, and I think this is like $20 for three of them, which is a pretty good deal to me. So this actually, I haven't even seen yet, and I'm actually excited about this because I ordered this, and I just got it because other moms recommended it, and I wanted to see if I would like it too. It's a diaper bag, and obviously this is my first time opening it. I just took it out of the plastic. And I got a navy blue one. Ooh, this is really nice. Oh, wow. Okay, so upon first glance, this is it. This is really nice. I love the colors on this. So this is like a dark blue, like a navy blue. And this is like a cream, like oatmeal type of color. Um, it kind of looks a little bit more gray on the camera, but it is more of like a cream color. It comes with a little pacifier pouch, which is super convenient. I absolutely love that. And it's a backpack because I don't have time to be carrying anything over my shoulder. So it's a nice little backpack. And let's see what the inside looks like. See if there's compartments in here. Oh my God, the space in here is actually insane. So it has a few different pockets. Um, it already comes with a changing pad, which is really nice. It has these pockets in here that you can just put anything in. It has side pockets for bottles if you use bottles. It has so many pockets for so many different things. So this backpack also came with something inside of it and I'm not really sure what it is so we're gonna open it. But to sum up so far, I absolutely love this bag. Holy cow. This is, let's see. This is, I'm assuming this is a burp, a burp cloth? Yeah, that's really sweet. That is so cute. This was inside of the bag. It's 100% cotton. And yeah, it feels really nice. And I believe that's just like a little burp cloth. Like, here you go, baby. <laughs> and I think this was only like $35. I didn't want to break the bank on a diaper bag just because 
is probably gonna get messy anyway. So another thing that my doulas have recommended to me was a nipple butter because when I breastfed Charlotte, I needed something so strong, but like not something that my baby wasn't really supposed to have or like get in their mouth, something that I could put on before breastfeeding and then after, something to soothe my nipples because they're going to be ripped apart. So they did recommend from Amazon I got it from. It's the brand Earth Mama, it's organics. Um, and it's just like a nipple butter. It's an organic nipple butter and they recommended this to me because a lot of their clients use it and they've been recommending it for years and they said it's absolutely amazing. There's not really many ingredients in here, although I do know that lanolin is not in this, which is really nice because I realized that Charlotte did not take well to that and it didn't really help me much either. And it's non-sticky and it's lanolin free. It just smells like cream. It just smells like pretty organic to me. And it's honestly just, just like a little butter. It looks like chapstick, to be honest. <laughs> but it looks a little thick, which is nice because that means it'll probably stay pretty well. So I got myself some nipple butter because your girl is gonna need this. <laughs> okay, so I have two more bags over here and then I got that giant green thing, which I will put back here now. Um, so I'm gonna go through these two bags and then we're gonna go on to these big boxes. Honestly, I forgot what this one is but we're gonna see together. So in this bag, let's see. We have this adorable little blue teddy bear with a blanket. So this is like a rolled up little blanket, which I'm gonna take out and clean, but this is so cute. Huggable friends and throw. This is going to be such a cute little teddy bear for him to hold onto when he can. Um, and then this is like a little blanket that I can wrap him up in. That is such a cute idea. I absolutely love this. Oh my goodness. So in the rest of this bag, whoa. In the rest of this bag is a ton of clothes. So we're gonna go through a lot of clothes again. And there is also these little toys in here. They're called my first keys. The keys are numbered one through five. And yeah, anyway, they're just like little keys that he can hold on to and touch and love and play with. So that's really cute. Okay, so little man got some pants, just like a pair of gray pants. Same pair, but in light blue. And then again in darker gray, no, lighter gray. So there's a dark gray and then there's a lighter gray. And then you got navy blue. So he's gonna be wearing a lot of pants. So these are awesome. They're in size zero to three months, which is perfect for the winter when he will be a newborn. He got, oh my God, look at this little cute onesie. Oh my God, this is the cutest thing. This is from the brand Gerber again. So Gerber is actually really coming in clutch with all of these clothes. I absolutely love this. So I'm just gonna kind of fly through these just because there's so many little clothes in here. These onesies, actually I'm noticing, they don't have the little mittens that can fold over over their hands. And that's totally fine because I don't need onesies with mittens on all of them. But it is cool that they do make those. But these are just like the generic ones that he can wear all the time, just like layered up with something. This is a really cute onesie with like all these stripes and colors. Oh my gosh, I love this. He's gonna be like the coolest little baby ever. Okay, so he has a few more regular onesies. They really got the idea that his theme is dinosaurs. But anyway, there are a few little more onesies. And then there are some zip up ones that are gonna be really cute. This one says make some noise. So these zip up ones are great for little pajamas. They have little feet on them. These are just little stars and it's black. He has a yellow one. Look at all of these. And he has two more onesies in this bag. <laughs> this one says hello and it's black and white striped. So stinking cute. And then he's got this white one with stars and moons on it and clouds. Very cool, so cute. Oh, this is super cute. Oh my God. Okay, so cute is just gonna be like the theme of this video because literally that's all I can say. These are bibs and it says, did you say food with a puppy on it? Because that is me and they already know. So like my son's gonna be the same way. So did you say food? And then there's this one with trucks and then there's this just little stripey one. How adorable. Oh, how does this go? Oh, this is cute. I'm gonna take this off of the, whoa, look how, oh my God. I'm not gonna say the word cute. 
look at this oh my god so this is like a little silicone teether and then this is just a little sloth that makes some noises has a little noisy leaf and it can hang off of his car seat handle so this is just something for him to look at which is really awesome oh my god it's like a little accordion okay oh my gosh he's gonna be the coolest dressed little boy oh my god he's got a little nike tracksuit are you kidding me <laughs> look at this oh my gosh so it's a little neon green and gray moment for him a little zip up onesie it doesn't have feet on it so he's just gonna be the coolest little dude anyway he's got a cute little hood on it oh my gosh this is the cutest little nike outfit ever and i did see that there was another nike outfit in there so let's see that one. Oh my gosh so this one is like a really bright orange i believe that's orange and a dark blue so freaking cute the same thing as the last one um no feet but it doesn't have the hood it just has like the raised collar on it i can't wait to put his little body in these and these are sizes three months they're both three months so he's going to be getting good use out of these definitely because it's like the perfect time frame for him all right so now oh my god now we're going into this big boy we're just going to do a big old lucky dip all right oh yeah mm, look at these they're like little footballs it's like a fleece onesie it has feeties on it and it's a zip up and it goes it's a one-way zip which is totally fine zero to three months that is the cutest little thing and this is the same material it's like that fleece with the footies has the one-way zip and just a cute little stripey moment for the boy oh are you joking this is are you kidding me hold on i gotta hide the tags because i want you to get the full effect of this onesie oh my gosh isn't that just so stinking cute look at these buttons look at the material it's like this little ribbed material it's so soft it has a hood it doesn't have the feet on it it buttons up both um it buttons up and down both legs this is so cute it's three to six months so this is nice and light for the springtime so this is actually perfect he's gonna love this and this was actually from marshall's and it was probably very inexpensive because marshall's is but it's such good quality i am so happy with that that is so stinking cute okay we have a big old pack of baby washcloths these these washcloths are amazing and honestly, I always forget to get them. And if I want to take a picture of him while he's in a tub, I got to cover up some things, you know, for the picture. So this is going to go right on top. And super good idea. I totally forgot about these. And they're little dinosaurs. Did you guys see that? They're little dinosaurs. How cute is that? Well, these are arrows, dinosaurs, dinosaurs. So cute. So there's eight of them in here. And they're going to go to such good use. Oh, I feel this already. Oh, there's socks. Oh, look at the socks. Okay, I'm sorry, but there's like nothing better to me than baby feet, like little tiny baby feet. I cannot get over how freaking tiny and how cute these little socks are. So two pairs of socks and then there's three bibs. So these are like those drooling bibs. It says three soft and absorbent bibs. Um, although I'm assuming they wear these just when they're teething. So that way when they're drool, when they drool, it doesn't get all over their clothes. But there's a gray one, maybe blue one, and then like a nice stripey one. So, oh, I love these so much. Okay, ooh, a pack of onesies. We love that. These are from Marshalls again, um, three to six months. And, oh, let me get the tag out of there. And they're cute little cars. Just a white onesie with gray and blue cars on it. A regular, just plain blue onesie. And then you got the striped onesie as well. So he's going to be set. And actually I really like that these are three to six months because he definitely needs more three to six month clothing, clothing because right now he just has everything for like the winter time. So those are gonna come in super handy once he is a little bit bigger and it starts to get a little bit warmer out. 
Oh, this is freaking cute. This is the same thing as what I showed you guys before, which I don't even know where it is right now, but it is the um, headrest for the car seat. So this is gonna go around his head in the car seat and you can probably see the detailing on it. Like it's really subtle, which I really like, but it has basketballs and baseball mitt and things like that on it. Um, and it's really, really soft, but this is a blanket for him as well as the the headrest so like the head support right here so this says it's good for a stroller or a car seat and it's a baby blanket belt strap covers and travel pillow so the belt strap covers are right here so they're gonna go over the little straps that go on his chest to make it a little bit more comfortable for him but yeah this is another cute little set which is adorable because phil and i are both into sports and we love this absolutely love this that is so amazing and it's so soft and squishy and he's he's gonna love it he's gonna love it okay look at this guy this is a dinosaur with little velcro feet which i can't take it off now because he is also um stra like strapped on there pretty good with some plastic pieces that i have to cut out <laughs> but anyway it's a little dinosaur that has like really long arms and legs and it can like hang from his car seat or it can hang from his crib and then there's a soft little squishy blanket to go along with it in that really nice like mint green color. So that is going to become in super handy as well because the winter time just cover his little feet and legs up with a blanket and give him something to look at, which is this little dinosaur guy. No, whoa, this thing is filled. This, oh my God, this is like a little dino infant hooded towel. Look at this bad boy. Holy cow, that is the cutest thing. Oh my God, is there more in this? I didn't even, wait. There are more things stuffed inside of this. It's not just a, it's not just a hooded towel. There are tiny little, oh my God, wait, are these little washcloths? There's tiny little washcloths stuck in there. Oh my gosh, look. Oh my god, they're little dinosaur washcloths. So there's two of them. There's two of these guys that I just showed you. And then there's just two plain blue ones. So I didn't know that. I just thought it was a... Oh my gosh. And then there's another little washcloth that's actually like a dinosaur stuffed in there too. It was all stuffed in the center. It was all stuffed in the center of that. Look it. Oh my gosh. I didn't even know this was in there. I did see this prior because my friend wanted me to open it. So I did in front of her, but I didn't even see this. This was a gift as well, which is super sweet. This is a big old laundry basket. I'm gonna put that over to the side because I have the remainder of everything in my lap right now. These are pacifier clips. We use these with Charlotte all the time. Um, and I say they because we have two. So we have like a gray one and then we have a like bluish one. These are just great. They just hook onto the onesie. If, if they like pacifiers, they just hook onto the onesie and there's like this little cord at the end that hooks onto the pacifier and that way if they spit it out, they don't lose it and it doesn't get gross and like land on the floor. So those are always really good to have. We had them with Charlotte and they were great. He got more pants, more cute little pantaloons and I'm taking these off of the little hanger to show you guys. These are size three months, which again, really great because we don't have a lot of three month or bigger clothing for him. So that, he's got those little dinosaur pants and he's got these just like light blue pair. They got him a pack of socks. These are three to 12 months. So depending on the size of his foot, he can wear these whenever. They have little dinosaurs on them. This one says roar. And then over here is just another little pair with dinosaur on them. So he's got six pairs of socks and he's got some onesies. Oh no, actually, this is a sleep sack. He has this one now, which he does have a gray striped one in his crib waiting for him, but then he's got this one with elephants on it. So we're gonna see if he enjoys the sleep sack. He's got this cute little onesie. It's actually a set, so it comes with a hat. It has this onesie that like buttons down the side to make changing diapers easy. And then it has the matching pants on the back, which have these adorable little footies on them, like little dinosaur feet. Um, and he also got, oh, another, Wait, is this? Yeah, I got another sleep sack. Okay, cool. So let's hope that he likes these. <laughs> and these are, this is size three to six months. Okay, so now we're on to the big things, which I am not even going to bother opening these boxes right now. I'm just gonna like put in some B-roll for this. 
Um, but this is his Graco swing. It had good reviews, but also because it was low to the ground, but then it can extend. It like folds up really nicely when you want to bring it places. And then we have this bassinet for him. We chose this bassinet because it had a lot of space at the bottom of it that we could use. And we just thought that it was really good because it had that little cover on the top of it. Okay, so the one thing that I managed to get out of the box uh, in one piece, which I will still show you guys once it's out of this box, is the Grow With Me bathtub. I chose this one because it has all different stages for him to grow into. And it just seemed like the best fit for us and what we would need and I absolutely love it and I love it because it has so many different stages for him it has a re really good seat for him when he's just born and then we can kind of go from there and just change it up every single time he gets a little bit bigger so the final thing that I do not have up here with me right now because it's too big is the stroller that we got for him so the stroller is amazing it has three wheels so two wheels in the back one wheel on the front, it rides really, really smoothly. The stroller also came with a matching car seat. It's this really dark color with these really nice gray accents to it. Everything is really soft, it's really well put together. There's a lot of storage on the bottom and it is just a really great stroller for him because it can also lay down in a bassinet position if I don't wanna put him in the car seat in the stroller. So I like to have those options and it was really amazing that we were able to get this. This was from our well, my in-laws, Phil's parents, and we are just really lucky to have them and to be able to have this. So this is a really great stroller and we are so grateful. So now that I am surrounded by all of these gifts, which I am not complaining about at all, we are super, super grateful for everything that we were given. I am going to go wash everything that I need to wash and then I'm going to put everything away where it needs to go. And then we're gonna, that's it, we're gonna call it a day. Okay, we're in a different position now because I don't know how I forgot. Oh my god, oh, oh, oh. Anyway, I just ripped the bag. I don't know how I forgot about this bag. It was just chilling over there. But anyway, it's time to take everything out of the boxes anyway. We just got a box of diapers, size two, just because we wanna have some diapers for when he's a little bit bigger. We got some newborn diapers. Lovely, great, we love that. We got some more newborn diapers. We got more of them, which is super handy. And we got a whole box of water wipes, which I really enjoy water wipes. I just think they're a little bit better for them. It doesn't have any of those like additives or anything. So yeah, we got the water wipes and that's that. So we're gonna be getting way more diapers for him um, and way more wipes for him, but we're gonna have to do that at a different time. But anyway, yeah, so I don't know how I forgot about that. I just was walking away from this mess, which I have right here. <laughs> and I was like, oh my God, I forgot about the diapers. So yeah, now the video is officially over, so bye. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for making it through this video. I know there was a lot of stuff, but I am very, very grateful for all of it. And so is Phil. We are so excited to welcome Little Man into this world. And it is just going to be such a good time. So if you wanna stick around for more videos like this, or if you just wanna come through our journey as having a newborn again and the last few months, weeks of, of my pregnancy, then definitely hit that subscribe button. And I hope you guys have an amazing day wherever you are. Do something to make it count. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.